Hello, welcome back to my channel. I am Simply Brentley. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. All right, and off of your, for all of your manifestation needs, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. This message is for the collective. This is for the collective. All right, this is your person's karmic. I feel like somebody has definitely been stalking you. Somebody has definitely um, been... Um, very not revealing themselves, like they're hiding behind false masks. If you are a reader or you have, uh, you know, any type of social media, they've been on there, they've been watching you, but they've been lurking. They've been watching you, okay? Let's get some wisdom of Oracle to see what's crowning this reading. Okay. This is somebody that wants to be like you, right? All right, all right. Round and around. And time to go. Flexible. What else? thinker. So this, this person has definitely been, they can't like, like I said, they're stalking you. You can't get, they can't get you out of your, they can't get you out of their mind, right? Any way they look, any, any way they turn, any way they try to flex, whatever, wherever they go, it doesn't matter where they go, anytime, anywhere, any place. They're thinking about you. They're all up in their head, right? They, they, I don't know. Look, nine of wands, is that because of that? Yeah, because you're a threat to this person. You're definitely a threat to this person. And um, they they feel like you're trying, you're trying to steal something that belongs to them, right? This is your person's karma. They feel like, you, but that, the truth is that it never belonged to them. It was always discord in the situation. Um... They can never see eye to eye. It was a situation that somebody was stuck possibly over children. It, it, it was not a situation that, like, it was always arguing, fussing, and fighting, all of that. But now since this person, look, three of swords, it flew right, all out in reverse, right? They're dwelling on past hurt. There's a lot of black grief. They're uneasy. They know that this was a third-party situation, right? Yes, yes, yes. And there's some heartbreak here. We have the uh, four swords in reverse. This person is very restless. Um, they're refusing to face opponents. Look, that's exactly what they're doing. Refusing to face. They're hiding behind false masks. Thank you, Spirit Guys, for confirmation. They're, they're, um, they're just sitting there being a computer thug. That's what they're doing. They're not coming to real life. They're not talking to you in real life. they they stalking you, looking at you, trying to get your mannerisms, trying to see why... why uh, their person that no longer want them wants you. It's because you're the motherfucking empress, first of all. You got your shit together. You're living in abundance. You're not on that karmic bullshit stalking nobody because you on that making your money, honey, right? You're finding strength, um, a balance. They know that this person would have balance with you. Uh, they know you're very knowledgeable. They know that this person is not satisfied with them. They're very bored with them. They're uninspired. This person is feeling left out at this time. They have a lot of resentment towards you. Um, we do have a message. So this person is definitely trying to send you a message. They're going to be trying to figure out every kind of way to contact you. They're going to deliver you a message. Girl, girl, boy, whoever. I mean that with love, right? Girl or boy, whoever is watching this right now. Sir, ma'am, king, queen, whatever you want me to call you. Let me tell you something. This person is very deceitful. So they may come to you. It may be somebody like a false, um, um, if I can even think of it. See, they don't want me to tell you this because they thought this is your warning. They thought that they had you, but they don't have you. So um, this, this could definitely be like a, um, a profile page that's made up. Um, 
anything of that nature. It's not going to be real. They're going to come at, come at you with some real karmic key shit. You're going to like know it's, it's them because they're coming at you so sideways and you know you're not even like that. So why is this person that coming at you like this? They must be disappointed in themselves, right? Yeah. Because they know that they living in their karmic energy and they're trying to be like you, trying to get like you, but they never will because you're vibrating higher. And you, it's a whole energy. And that could not be, could not be duplicated, right? If it's not genuine. And this is not genuine. Period. Point blank. Thank you. Ace of Swords. Yeah. Uh, they know that this person that they had stuck in the past has gained mental clarity. That shit is no longer. Um, they're, they're breaking through. They're finding out the truth about this karmic person. There's a lot of shit that's been hidden about this karmic person. Addiction, lies, um, promiscuity. Um, if I could talk. Very promiscuous. Um... Eight of Swords, yeah, they're withdrawing. They see their person withdrawing. They say their person holding back. They see their person letting go. They see their person changing priorities. They see their person um, leaving them in the past. And Ten of Pentacles. Because they see help and um, wealth, happiness. Um, they, they see a, a future with you. They want to make those investments with you. You have history. This is definitely from the past. Um... <clears throat> So yes, yes, yes. This karmic person is definitely trying to get you down. Don't let them get you down. Keep on moving. Keep on doing you because as long as you're vibrating higher, they can't touch you anyway, right? They can't touch you anyway as long as you're vibrating higher. I cut the duck deck two times, y'all. First, I got Ace of Wands and then I got um, Ace of Cups, right? So yes. And then we already have the... Oh, oh, never mind. Oh, yeah, we do. Okay, okay. We already have the Ace of Swords. So we have three Aces. We have three Aces out here. For sure. It, it's definitely... And look look what I have after that. Fast movement. Yes, this person is definitely getting mental clarity. They find you very creative. Uh, they do want to have this new love with you. They find it very compassionate. They're trying to find the will and determination. And this person knows this. This person finally knows that all those feels, all those things that were keeping them stuck, all them secrets, all those things that this person um, was believing is no longer. And they want to move and have progress with you. And that's period. And that's why this person is stalking you, being very karmic-y with all those... Um, you know, all those little whatever, the trying to be quick with it and saying shit that they know out their mouth before they said it won't true. They ain't heard it from nowhere but themselves. Like, they're just jealous and envious of you. And they ain't going to get nowhere until they work on themselves. And this person is, is, is moving away. They're moving away from all of that karmic shit. They're tired of fighting, fussing, arguing. Maybe if you got your shit together and stopped fighting, fussing, arguing and worked on yourself and took care of better care of yourself and started to do what the fuck you needed to do, own some businesses and get your shit together, then your person wouldn't be like this towards you, right? If if they got that shit together, then then you know what I'm you know what I'm saying? That's why they're coming towards you, because they don't got time for the petty games no more. But and they know they that you need balance. They know that it's gonna have to have balance here, right? They're going to have to put that karmic in their place and tell them to sit the fuck down and, and work on them, right? All right, all right, all right. As always, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to get your energy in. As always, peace, love, and namaste.